it's the Lola's for me. <laughs> hey girl, listen. So um, one of the questions is, someone asks is, will I buy back my babies that I've had in the past? Typically that's a no. I typically don't like to go backwards. I like to move forward. If I've already seen them before, something about them allowed me to part with them, then typically no. Um, also, every collector take care of their babies differently and especially if they've been around the globe and back, I don't want them, keep them out there, it's over, we've had our time. Um, however, there are maybe, you know, a handful of babies that I might would consider taking back. Um, one baby for sure that I know that I probably shouldn't have never sold was Puck Santana. That's one. Um, another baby that I would have, um, that I regret. I don't regret selling Puck, but I do regret selling Jade. Um, that was another baby that I should have kept. Those are probably the only two, believe it or not, um, Puck and Jade, that I would want back if I had the opportunity to get back. Um, and I'll tell you, Puck was flawless. Jade was flawless. They're, um... I'm going to say for me, Jay, it was a skin tone and the sentimental values that sits with her. Um, so for whatever reasons, um, at the time with Jade, I had to puck. I really didn't. I just did it because you know how I do. Move into the next thing. Okay, I can let him go type thing. And plus I knew the person he was going to typically is someone that keeps their babies forever. Um but hey we all get to a point where it'd be like okay somebody gotta go so um for me i just don't buy them back um but i don't see nothing wrong with it if you find that you really really love a baby and you want it back but i did that once with a baby i traded back with someone to get it back and i eventually end up selling her anyway again so just to do it back, just to do it do it all over again, no. I'm not going to traumatize myself over and over again with the same same trauma. So, typically, no. Um, would I buy a second market? Do I think second market is worth it? I think, yes. I will buy a second market. Just depends. I need to know the history of the doll, the collectors that whom it's been with because... That makes a difference to me if I want to even take a chance of having it because, you know, collectors handle their babies differently. Um, and if it's a baby that I can't get or get one of its caliber new, then yes. And the other thing is if the baby is, um, if it's a good buy, if it's a really good buy, Yes. Um, if I'm going to save money on second market, then yes, I will buy second market. I have friends that literally know that they want a baby and will wait. <laughs> will wait until somebody, a new edition can come out and they'll be like, somebody going to get it and sell it after a while, a few months. And they wait for the second market. And that's how they do their collection. All their collection pretty much is second market because that's what they do. So listen, there is so many different ways to collect these babies. Um, a lot of people, you know, and I'm going to tell you something what I hate. You know, you make people can't stand you when you do this stuff. But <laughs> I'm sorry, it was, that's a part of a movie that my mom keep quoting and it's in my head. But one of the things that I can't stand, I can't stand when people go on people posts and videos and like, try to price shame them or make negative comments like go get your own channel do your own video and if you want to give your opinion there then do it i mean it's one thing if you do in a healthy debate if it's something that's debatable but to be on there be like girl I could, why are you spending sending selling your dolls for this much there's too much money to be selling dolls for. girl why are you doing that or you know 
it don't look like a real baby to me or da 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 you can't do that on somebody else's post. You got to have your own commentary on your own channel. I mean, not that you should be going around doing that type of stuff, but I just think it's so rude. I hate to see that. Even if I agree with a comment, child, I'd be like, well, child, she said what I was thinking. But you wrong for that, sis. Don't be putting that on a girl channel like that. Because, <laughs> you know, I don't know. I'll be feeling some type of way. Either. But see, I, my delete game is strong. I'd be like, delete, 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 delete. <laughs> and then, look. And yeah, I used to be, people be like, oh, if you don't agree with them, they're going to delete your comments and all this. Yep. <laughs> no, you don't have to agree. Um, it's just that you just can't be outright rude or disrespectful or hurting my abilities to sell or something like that. And that's, you know, that's different when it's my business and I'm trying to sell something and you're talking about this too high. Uh-uh, you got to go, sis. Um... Because it, you know, I don't know. But anyway, but did I tell y'all that my mom came over the other day and she, she, she met Major and she was like, this baby look like he gonna wake up any day, like any minute, not day. She was like, he just looked like he gonna move. So that was a compliment. She was like, he is so pretty. She was like, oh my God, she looks so real. And she said, you're doing so much. She said, you're doing so much better with your skin tones and everything. I was so happy. Yay. But she was like, mm, mm But she was like, it's that new baby for me. And I was like, what new baby? And she was like, the happy one. And I was like, Cody Bear. And she was like, yeah. I was like, you want me to bring him down here? You want to come up here and see him? And she was like, I'm going to come up down. Baby, I'm going to climb the steps to come see, see Cody Bear. And she was just playing with him, like, you know, looking at And she's like. Oh my, she's, she was like, he is everything. She was like, I love him. So, that is a big to-do. And I'm going to tell y'all why. Y'all don't be offended. Y'all y'all light-skinned people don't be offended. Y'all red bones, yellow bones, whatever y'all want to call yourself. Um, But my mom typically is drawn to the darker babies. Like, Ada and Kingsley is her speed, right? Um... So, for her to like Cody as much as she do, that was a huge compliment. She was like, he just looks so real. And then my daughter came right behind her and said the same thing. And then, she, and then my daughter, my daughter be getting on my nerves though. Y'all know, y'all have met Tabitha before. She a hot mess. She get on my nerves. She, this is what she always say. When she like a baby a lot, she'll be like, oh, you painted that one? So what you trying to say? She was like, oh, okay. Then she started pulling out her camera, trying to put them on her Snapchat and all that stuff. I'm like, don't do me. Don't do me. She told me something. Oh, oh, you painted them? I sure did. Gosh. Oh, what you trying to say? Because sometimes they be like, you, it, never mind. I ain't going to tell y'all what they be saying because y'all be feeling some type of way if I tell y'all. But, um... Yeah, and I got this one little baby here, and I I think sometimes I could tell, like, if they, I said, well, mama, you ain't saying nothing about this baby. She was like, oh, she all right. She cute. Okay, so that means she, she ain't standing out. Like, she ain't popping. And then I got some babies, my mom just walked right past, and I'm like, you know how you think, you, you know how you have a baby that you think is all that, and... You think that everybody going to draw to that baby? Mm-mm. She just walked right past it. She she did make one little comment like, oh, who that, that little baby is? And then I said, whatever. And she was like, oh. And she went to the other baby and started playing with the other baby. And I'm like, did she just dismiss this baby over here that's supposed to be? That's the goat right now. Ma, that's the goat. Mm-mm, baby. That's the sheep. <laughs> But anyway, my mom is a mess, but it's nice. Um, they're not real co collectors, so I'll be honest with y'all. That's just like outings. I don't really get hyped up when people are like, oh my God, this baby's so real. Da -da 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 -da. You know, I do get hyped up when people think it's just a real baby and they literally can't tell the difference. That's different than them like, oh my God, that doll looks so real. When, so the moment they say that doll, it's a no for me. When they say baby, when they refer baby, 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 then I take it as a little compliment. But 
when people not real collectors, they don't know what they're comparing it to. This is their first time. They basically comparing your baby to a Walmart doll. So anything look real to them beyond that. So, I mean, not to, you know, rain on nobody parade or anything. I'm just saying. So, it's, but my mom and my kids have grew up in this with me. They have seen the babies that I've seen, except for the doll shows, because I have always shown my mom my dolls and my kids have been here in the house with me when I was collecting the bulk of my dolls. When By the time they got grown and moved out, I was starting to do my own thing more so. But they have always been around and seen the dolls that came through. So their opinion kind of matter, you know, but not enough to make me feel any type of way about my babies but yeah so it's nice it's really nice um it's nice to have you know differences of opinions but anyway I'm gonna go I need to go put um this baby head back on because I took it apart because I was gonna send her off to the rooter and then I decided to send another baby off to the rooter instead so, but let me show y'all since it's right here. So y'all can see the difference in the skin tones. Because a lot of people don't understand that even though there are so many different shades. And so this is Maggie. And as you can see, Maggie has a total different skin tone. Um, although she is equally light. She has some really nice texturing stuff on her nosy. So she has little things that you don't pick up on camera. Um, so she's going to be, she's going to get rooted. Um, and so I, when she gets rooted, that'll be that. But in the meantime, I'm going to put her head back on so she can, she can be loved on. In, in between but it's funny because I did her she's kind of I don't know her her style of painting is a little different but they kind of I don't know I don't know it's almost like so Cody I don't know for me Cody looks biracial to me she looks Caucasian but they're both biracial babies maybe when she get hair but i don't know we'll see i don't know but this their coloring is different very different but anyway i just thought i would show that to you guys so you guys would see them side to side i like putting my babies that's similar in skin tones side by side like that because i think when you see when people see that see them they think, oh, that's the same color. But those are the colors that I enjoy painting. I really enjoy painting. I won't lie. I enjoy painting the light skinned babies. Don't come for me. But I do. I enjoy painting the light skinned babies. I love the beautiful chocolates, but it's just not my strong suit. Um, you know, some people, people that have gotten my chocolate babies love them and said I did a really good job. But I think this is my strong suit, the biracial or lighter babies, because that's what... I'm accustomed to seeing, if that makes sense. Um, so, yeah. So, it, you know, it makes sense to me. But, anyway, anyhow, thanks for watching. Um, Cody Bear, oh yeah, quick, quick. Cody Bear uh, is in production. Um, Laura commented on one of my posts. And he is in production so he may be here his kids may be back in stock by the end of this month so that's going to be exciting guys if you missed out on the pre-orders i would definitely go then and there will be some kits some extra kits available so um if you missed out go run and get them because it's a lot of people waiting for them to come in and i don't think i really think this is going to be a kit that's going to sell out honestly because it's so versatile it can be a, a beautiful girl. It can be a beautiful boy. It can be a toddler. It can be a baby, like an in-between baby, like I have mine. Um, so I think it's gonna, I think it's gonna sell out. So anyway, bye, bye guys, bye, bye, bye. Say bye, bye.
Tell him bye-bye. He can't tell you about that right now.